Now, before we dive in, if you find my videos useful, make sure to click that subscribe button and also make sure to click that bell icon on the side to get notified every time I upload a new video. And of course, if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, make sure to follow me on all at Saki Tech Online, also for the latest updates. All right, let's dive in. Hey guys, Sock here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I wanna talk about the brand new update for the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 and the Note 10 Plus. So let's dive in and see what's new. So I wanna go into my uh, settings over here, and then you wanna scroll all the way down go into your software update. Now, if you haven't received the update yet, tap on download and install to, to see if it's available. And then let's go over here, that's the last update. So here's what's new. Now we do have the June security patch, which is always a good thing. The size of this update should be approximately 620 megabytes, which varies based on region and carrier slightly. And then the version here, it ends in E7. Now we have all the regular stability improvements and bug fixes, but on top of that, we actually have some improvements to the camera, to the Wi-Fi, and the touch screen. Now with the touch screen, I'll let you know right away. I notice better touch responsiveness as I interact with the screen. It's just a hair better, but I can actually sense it. You guys can check it before the update, and after the update, it just feels slightly smoother as I scroll through the screen, okay? So that's fantastic. And the other thing uh, is, is the camera. Uh, I did see a brand new feature in the camera. Now some cameras already had this, but I just got it today. And that's this option right here, uh, the ability to create filters from your photo. So you take a photo and you can actually create filters off of it. And that's this feature right here in the middle. And of course, on top of this, the camera has actually been further improved and stabilized. So the focus performance and the speed at which it takes a photo is now increased. And that's basically the overall update, okay? Nothing too fancy, uh, but little enhancements that do add up to some major improvements over time. Now, one more thing I did test was the Wi-Fi connectivity. So the stability has been improved. And in my case, when I go all the way down to my kitchen, my Wi-Fi gets a little bit weak I only get two bars, but now when I went today, after the update, I was getting three bars. So that could be the stability they're talking about. And of course, I have a quick present for you guys. If you wanna download this wallpaper right here for free, uh, this one, the lock screen, which is actually a fantastic wallpaper, check the link down below to my video that allows you to download uh, this wallpaper and four more uh, for free, okay? This is a fantastic wallpaper that's gonna enhance your smartphone works on any Samsung Galaxy smartphone. But anyway, that's the full update. Like I said, check it out, just grab it and install it, and it's simply gonna improve your smartphone. And for anybody that's wondering, we have nothing new for the actual aspect. Anyway guys, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below, and I will let you know, this is an unlocked version of Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus, and my region is United States. So if you don't have this update yet, you'll be getting it soon. The updates are slightly scattered throughout the world between different regions and carriers. All right, have a fantastic day. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.